Zoom keep introducing new features and now they've got Zoom virtual makeup filters and they actually work really well. You can use this feature if you want to do some eyebrow touch-ups, put on some lippy for the day or even grow a beard. Or maybe you just want to mess around with some fun colours and even represent your footy team. As usual, you want to update to the latest version and in this case you'll need version 5.3. So go ahead and click your avatar on the top right, click check for updates and it'll prompt you if you need to install the latest version. So go ahead and do that. Once completed, hit the settings button and come down to backgrounds and filters. Then head over to Studio FX Beta. So you can play around with these inside a meeting or outside a meeting, but you might want to just get familiar with it outside a meeting for now. And so as I mentioned earlier, you can give yourself a set of eyebrows, a beard, and even uh, some lipstick there. Now for the first two effects, you have different styles you can choose from. So different style eyebrows here, or different style beards. And then for all three, you can change from some of the preset colors, or go for a custom color, as well as be able to change the opacity. And for the lipstick color, we have a few more preset colors, and then of course, the custom color there as well. So with regard to the opacity, you can see that at the moment, I have the opacity all the way up, and that makes it very drastic, and I can come all the way down to being quite subtle, which maybe in my next meeting, I might pop on a few people and see if they can pick up that I'm using some lipstick. Maybe not. And again, for the beard as well, you can't quite see it because I've actually got myself a real beard here. Um, let's give myself uh, something a bit more bigger and more colorful. And again, you can see with the opacity, you can bring down the effect or leave it tuned right up. So you've got a few different beard options there to choose from. And same with the eyebrows, you've got your different styles. You can change the color and crank up the effect or drop it right back. So while Zoom have been gradually introducing these new features, they've taken care to make sure that it works with the other features. And one of those is the virtual background feature. And you can see all about how to use the virtual background in Zoom in a video right here. So as you can see, as we click a virtual background, we can see that that is working nicely. So that's great. The studio makeup effects also work with the video filters. Now this is another recent addition for Zoom. And if you wanna know more about that, I've also done a video all about it in the video right here. So check that one out. And you can see as we select one of these video filters that that's working nicely in combination with the studio makeup effects and the virtual background. Let's maybe even choose this one here. Go with the green option for the eyebrows. Go with the green beard. Maybe even throw in some green lippy. And now we're gonna be naughty. Be the Grinch and still Christmas. Ah, uh, watch this video next if you wanna learn how to look good on video calls without having to wear all this silly makeup stuff. So click that one and I'll see you there. And don't tell me that my shadow wouldn't allow it.